So what's the big news, Marty? Uh, I don't understand. Where's everyone else? I said gather all the dudes to the table. Where's Troy and Nathan? Well, where are those two? Nathan. Yeah? Have you seen my tie? No. Oh, the, the one that I like very much. No, I haven't one seen it. shapes on it. No. Sorry. Oh my, have you seen these photos? GQ's 50 hottest fashion photos? Oh my god, I'm looking at these women's hips and it's driving me crazy! I oh. found it. Do you like it? Do you, do you think it matches uh, yes. it looks, my jeans? It looks fine. Do you think it's... Too... It looks good. It looks good. Do you think it looks a little bit like... Oh my god, are these women's, ratty, women's yeah. breasts? Do you see this? Do you see this? Look at that. You're not listening to anything I'm saying right now. I'm listening. You're looking for your tie. You're, you're, you want to know if it looks good. It looks fine. Well, did you know that I wanted to go get a couple of other ones because this one's falling apart? Is this, is this falling? Well, regardless of whether or not it's falling apart, I think you need new ties anyway. You know, you're dressing like you're still a teenager. Young kids wear skinny ties. Grown, classy men wear fat ties. I think you need to get Are you saying that I'm getting ties. old? I'm not saying you're Are you old. saying that I'm old now? Okay, you're older than you were. So am I. Who gives a hooey? Nathan! What? If you can't give a hooey about our relationship, what? Where is my ground to have a hooey about this relationship? I, give... I feel like I give double hooey. Oh, come on, I know that. And I give hooey too. I give gosh darn hooey, double hooey, every single day of my life and every thought and action. And it's all about you. Okay? I care about this relationship. I don't think there's any larger issue at hand here. I was merely commenting about how I think that as you grow older and change station in life, that you need to adapt your fashion too. And it's like my mom always said, dress for the job you want and not the job you have. But if you want to keep on wearing skinny ties, by all means, just don't ask my opinion. Because I'll tell you the God's honest truth. Nathan, I'm sorry. I've been been totally brazen this entire conversation. I just... What you said to me about your mother and ties, it really, you know, it struck a chord in my heart. That's a truism. It's a truism. And I, I, I should. I know it. And you're just giving me advice that you think would better me as a person. Right. But, as you know, my mother... She went, she went north, I and I, I don't want our relationship to go north either. Right. So I, I just, I guess what I'm trying to say is I've, I've always kind of looked at you like I looked at my mother. So you're like yeah, a mother to me, and I was wondering if, if it wouldn't be too weird if we could, if I could just call you mama. That's totally fine. Totally fine. And you know what I think we need tonight? Why don't we go out tonight? Why don't you and I, Troy and Nathan, go to Joe's Crab Shack, get some crabs and some butter sauce? Oh, you really mean it? Oh, I mean it. <laughs> <laughs> Who, is Who is it? it? Hey, fellas. Oh, howdy, Oscar. Hey. It's the grouch. <laughs> oh, you stop it. Alright, uh, Marty has some big news. Uh, he wants a house meeting, so do you guys want to go upstairs? Yeah. Oh, Alright, yeah. I'll see you there. Great. Who's Marty? Hey, Marty. Ah. Oh, hey. Good, good, good. Uh, so what's the news, Marty? Yeah, tell us, Marty. <laughs> Well, okay. I saw a program on the TV, and the red-haired man on the program told me that I could be a rock star. Me, Marty, I've always wanted to be a rock star. So you can understand my excitement. I called the number on the bottom of the screen. The woman on the phone said, here's how you can be a rock star, and she listed tips. And I've decided, I'm going to start a rock band. 
Mm. I'm shitting me, right? Pretty sweet, huh? I'm oh. smitten with the idea. I'm excited. I can play everything. Oscar, I want you to keep my beat. You're gonna be my drummer. Troy, boom, 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 boom. You're gonna be the bass man. Uh, Nathan, you can axe out, right? I'm gonna make you my guitarist. Wait a minute now. I don't know if you know this or not, but I play a mean guitar. Check it out. Uh, I mean, I can do it. I, I mean, I know that you've never seen me play before. This guy here. Yeah. What? Well, I mean, I think I, I think I can rock out harder than you can. You, you know that I practice every single day. Yeah, I, I hear you. I hear you trying to practice, but you can't get through two notes in a oh, song. Oh, really? And have I ever heard you play? Do you ever play? You're always watching TV. Whoa, whoa, guys, guys, calm down. I've got a solution for this. I'm gonna hold an audition. You two guitarists over here, you rock out for me, show me what you got. I'll pick one of you to be the guitarist for the band. That sounds like a deal. It's on. You sucker! Too slow. You're no good.